How are you feeling? I feel good so far. I'm nervous. So today is Monday and it's also a day that I don't really want to have right now. I'm getting ready to go in for surgery on my foot. I'm not looking forward to this, but at the same time I know that it's gonna it's gonna be a good thing in the long run. So from my understanding, what I have on my foot is a tear, a fracture, and at 25 years old I have bunions. <laughs> So they're gonna fix the tear, they're gonna take the fracture, and then also the bunion. So I'll have better looking feet. <laughs> With me here today, I have my mom, my dad, and then two of my siblings, and then Logan! <laughs> we have all of them here. And then Friday, uh, my best friend Karina's coming out. She's gonna be my chauffeur, she's gonna drive me to LA for the A1 combat fights. Amar Hernandez is fighting, I believe, co main event. So it should be really good. I talk a lot with my hands. That's what, that's what seems to not like my foot not like. That seems to be what my foot does not like. There's nothing in that. I swear, I just can't talk. Did the surgeon tell you anything? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Boss. <laughs> I don't know. I was out. Well, Get to go home. And then later, after your dress, we're going to do the fracture. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, I'm familiar with this. Look at that. <laughs> your leg looks great. Yeah. Looks tan with all their paint on there. <laughs> Oh, is that what that is? Well, it's, um, it's, uh, what's it called? Stuff for germs. Where you want to sit, huh? You want to sit in front? Is this a car? Oh, it's cool. So what we think is that it like completely tore the rest of the way, my big toe anyways, like the, the little spot that I had a tear in. We think that it happened when I kicked, we're assuming, because after mo the majority of my pain happened a lot more significantly after my last fight. Before that, I was in quite a bit of pain as well, just from like general pain that I've already been having. So I had two cortisone injections before, and then after the fight, then I was like, look, I can't, I can't. I can't handle this anymore um, and you can only have so many cortisone injections obviously with my family I made the decision and then also with Hunter Mick and Dana I just talked to them and they were like look 
that was the time let's get it done so we got it done but yeah like as far as like the pain like i was already in a little bit of pain but after the fight i was in like so much more pain just like walking um anytime i would wear shoes training like certain things i couldn't do like i couldn't do like shots and i couldn't do pushing off of my foot it just hurt all the time can't run um, and obviously a lot of those things are just so important when you're in camp that you know, it's not something I want to sacrifice and compromise my camp for. So the benefit of being a professional athlete is a lot of things can get moved around really quick. And when I was first talking to like surgeons and doctors, they were like talking about scheduling surgery out like eight to 10 weeks out. And I remember I went to Hunter's office just like two, a couple weeks ago. And I was telling him about it. And I was like, yeah, they're telling me this long. And he was like, no, we're not going to do that. So uh, they made the call. We just they literally booked me that next week. So they made a lot of things happen. And obviously Dana and Hunter and Mick, the, the whole UFC like helps out a ton uh, with getting this type of thing fixed and, and taken care of in a very timely manner. I'm a little bit frustrated that I didn't take care of it right after my last fight. But again, like going from one doctor to the next to the next, you get passed around a lot. And it's something where it's like they don't move very fast. <laughs> So to have people who can pull strings on, on your side is, has been very incredible. I think the plan for tonight is obviously I'm just gonna rest some more, probably ice my leg a little bit more, keep it elevated. And then we've been playing phase 10, my parents and me and my two younger siblings. Um, this time we got Logan here, so we're gonna beat him with that game. <laughs> and then rest all day tomorrow. And then on Wednesday, I'm gonna head to the PI, see Heather and see how all that goes. I'm not sure what that all entails yet, so. Stay tuned.